Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to um, create a sheet on the S or on the strategy sheet for affiliate. And the first thing you have to do is go into SEM Rush. If you need the password, please contact someone on the affiliate team, and they will get that to you. Then you go to the keyword magic tool. Once you go to the keyword magic tool, you're going to type in the keyword that you think is most relevant, that we tell you is most relevant, um, and you're going to search that. And if there's a better one, you might take it. But in this case, we will go with Best Protein Powders. It has 3,600 volumes, so that looks good. From there, it will take you to a page that talks about this keyword. And then what we will do is we will go down to the SERP analysis, which stands for Search Engine Results page. And this is all of the top ranking keywords for, or top ranking articles for this particular best protein powders keyword. I will download this as a CSV. And then what I will do is upload it. Oh, well, I will save it. And then I will upload it to my strategy sheet. So to upload it to your strategy sheet, you go to file, import, uh, then you can um, upload and drag that CSV file into the upload section. And this is very important. Make sure you insert as a new sheet. Do not replace the current sheet. Import that data. It will all transfer over. Um, uh, then what we do is we name this best, what the keyword is, which is best protein powders, but then the date that we pulled it on, and the date today is 9-30-2021, and now we have a list of all the articles that rank for best protein powders, right? But this list is not telling us, what we want to do is we're going to create a column to the left by right-clicking, um, insert one left, then we're going to put rank. From there, we're going to go one, two, three, to start that sequence, we're gonna grab that sequence and we are going to pull it all the way down so that um, we have the ranking for each of these articles because this is by their current rank. We are going to click the top row. We're going to click view, freeze this row. That way, when we scroll down, it stays the same. Then, top left corner, click on that and we're gonna filter the whole sheet. What this does now is now let's say I don't want to just look at by the rank. I want to look at by traffic. I can do that. And wow, this one is ranking 63, but still has a lot more traffic than some of the second ranked articles. So there might be times where we want to look at it that way. So we'll sort that. I like to um, wrap this first section. Uh, then we want to uh, set up the next part. And the next part is basically <coughs> copying you know, these sections here, um, we want to know whether the article is relevant, uh, the teammates outlet record, the contact record, outreach record, then any specific notes. Um, from there, you'll see that on other sheets, we have uh, a few different options when it comes to relevancy. To create that, all you have to do is click on the top row, hold shift command, and then the down arrow, uh, if you are on a Mac, go to data validation, list of items, uh, then you can go ahead and input the items that you want. So yes, no, maybe, only uh, links to Amazon or only links to retailers. And that is how we set up a um, spreadsheet for our organic search review uh, and our gap analysis sheet.